Previously, we saw how to register an on-prem server to any point platform. We also deployed an application to the on-prem server from the AnyPoint platform. In, the, in case you have missed the previous video, please click on the card at the top right corner to visit the video. So now, in this video, uh, as we had previously deployed the application uh, from uh, AnyPoint platform to the on-prem server, in so it looks good, everything works fine, but how about some automation? I mean, I don't want to manually go to the AnyPoint platform and deploy the application. I want it to be done by the Mule Maven plugin. So we have learnt a few things about the Mule Maven plugin in the previous video. You can visit those video. Uh, the link is in the description or it would pop up at the top right corner of your screen. So let's see how we can use Mule Maven plugin to deploy the application to a on-prem server. So in previous videos we have seen uh, we have deployed the application using Mule Maven plugin to cloud up but this time we are going to deploy it on-prem. So this is the same application that I've used in previous videos uh, the hello world application. Now what we have to do is we have to change this configuration from Cloud Hub deployment to an on-prem deployment. So to do that, we have a tag called ARM deployment. Okay, and this in this ARM deployment, you have to mention a few things. For example, target. Target is the name of server. Uh, since your AnyPoint platform would have two targets as of now, uh, if you can see the deployment target over here it talks about this which is cloud hub and on-prem so we are interested in on-prem so we'll have that value as on-prem server so if you can see the target value uh, what I've given is is on-prem server okay the target type target type is a server that has been hosted on my local machine credentials even this thing has been discussed in the previous video you can watch them by clicking on the card above so this uh, this is where my credentials are stored in settings.xml this is my settings.xml and I have created I have encrypted the password using a master password which is present in setting security and I have stored in the settings.xml okay now next is the environment uh, it's sandbox as of, as of now so we'll pass it as sandbox and the mule version so these are few parameters that you have to pass and your on-prem deployment would be automated you need not go to the platform and manually deploy it instead you can utilize mules maven plugin so let's get rid of this cloud hub deployment and paste this ARM deployment instead just a bit of indentation so that it looks better okay now as the configuration has been done it's time to run this maven command so let's copy this and navigate to this demo app we have it let's open up a command prompt I paste the link and hit enter so hopefully it should deploy the application to your on-prem server that is the mule server that is running right now So it will take some time while it fetches the dependencies and creates the jar then it will deploy. So it says it's deploying artifact demo app. 
let's see if we can see in the runtime manager no it is not yet visible let's wait okay so it has appeared right now demo app server is on prem server and the status is starting it will take a moment and get installed okay so the application is started now this is lagging a bit it ta it does take time so, but uh, as we can see w the app has been successfully deployed and it's running so target status it's running okay target name is on prem server so let's try to hit and get the output so there we are we have got the hello world output so in this uh, series of videos we have learned to have an on prem server connected with the anypoint platform so on prem server is your runtime plane and the anypoint platform is your control plane we also learn how to deploy the application then we moved on to automating the deployment deploying Uh, using the mule maven plugin so in further videos we'll move on to a bit of more automation using jenkins so the idea of getting all this uh, getting you familiar familiarize with mule maven plugin was to move towards jenkins so now that we have all the topics covered we'll shift towards uh, jenkins and ha have jenkins execute this command instead of manually doing so Thanks for watching the video. Uh, see you in next video.